Okay, so now start reading exercise number two from the right side. Okay. The G U Yes. Ka Good. T Yes. Wu B U um, Ri Good. Ri Na uh, he good to pa who he mm. za yes su u yes ki <coughs> li di zi a da mu zu shu Da. Da. Yes. Oh yeah, sorry. Da. Da. Me. Good. So now we'll start the lesson number three, and today we'll study the absence of vowel, which is card scone. The scone symbol is made here. So start reading it. Okay. Um. This this circle above the letter is called scone. It indicates that such a letter is not followed by any vowel sound, but the alphabet with sukun is joined with the former alphabet. Yes. Uh, so basically, here this uh, whenever there is a sukun on any alphabet, it does not has any voice. So we merge it with the last alphabet. So now we read this table from the right side. Alif fata a ba sakin ab. Then Alif Kasra E Ba Sakin Ib Alif Dama U Ba Sakin Ub Alif Fata A Jim Sakin Aj Alif Kasra E Jim Sakin Ij Alif Dama U Jim Sakin Uj So try to read it like this from the right side. Okay. Alif Dama A Alif Fata Oh Fata sorry Yes uh, Alif Fata A Ba Sakin Ba Sakin Ab Good Alif Kazra E Ba Sakin Yes Ib. Good Alif Alif Dama U ba sakin ub good alif um fata a jim sakin aj good alif kazra e jim sakin ich good alif dama u jim sakin uch good Alif Fata A Da Sakin Ad Alif Kazra E Da Sakin E Dal Alif Dal Dal Sai Alif Dama U Dal Sakin Ud Alif Fata A Sim Sakin As mm. Alif um, Kazra I Sin Sakin Is Alif Dama U Sin Sakin Us Alif Fata A Ta Sakin Ot mm. Alif Kazra E Ta Sakin E Good Alif Dama U Ta Sakin Ut Alif Fata A Rain Sakin Ah Ag 
Og. Good. Ali. Kazra i. Klein. Sakin. Ich. Ig. 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 Good. Alif dama u. Klein uh, uh, uh. 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 Alif ta a pa sakin ap. Good. Alif kazra i kof sakin ich. Ek. Ek. Good. Uh, alif tama u kaf sakin uk good alif fata a lam sakin al good alif kazra i min sakin um, im good alif dama u nun sakin un Jim Fata Ja Noon Sakun Jan 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 uh, Jim Kazra Ji Noon Sakun Jin Noon Sakin Jin Good In Jin um, Dal Kazra Di Noon Sakin Good. Dal, dal, dama du, rosakin tur. Good. Of dama ku, lam, sakin kul. Good. Pa dama u, min sakin. Home. Home. Good. Now we will begin again from the start and read it like this Ab, Ib, Ub, Aj, Ij, Uj. So start again. Okay. Ab, Ib, Ub, Aj, Ij, Uj, Ad, Id, Ud, As. Is us good at it ut ah or how would I say that? Ag. Ag. Okay, ig ug good um, af ik uk good al. Im un dan jin un this is un <coughs> this is un un oh which one um uh, <coughs> alif dhamma okay. u nun sakin un oh, okay okay un chan jin Good. Um, Dean. Yes. Dur. 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 Um. Cool. Yes. And whom? Good. Now we will proceed to the next exercise, which is exercise number three. So start it from the right side and read it vertically. Okay. Ab, Ib, Ub, Aj, Ij, Uj, Ad, Id, Ud, As, Is, Us, At, it. It. Yes. Oh yeah, sorry. It. Ud. Yes. 
الف کسرا ای غائن ساکن اغ 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 And the alphabet Gain is pronounced from the upper part of the neck. Ig Gain, oh. upper part of the neck. Ig Gain, yes. Ig, okay. Um, this one be Uk. Yes, Uk, correct. Im. Yes. Im. Good. If. Uf. As. Ash. Ash. Osh. Ash. Ish. Ush. Ak. Yes. Uf. Ar. Ir. Ur. Yes. Ha. Ah. Ha. Ah. Ha. Yes. Ah. Good. Oh, okay. I. U. Yes. Um. As. Yes. Is. Us. Ah. Alif Fata Ain Sakin A A I U Good As Is Us Is that it? Yes, there is another column left. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. Yes. <laughs> okay. Um. Oh. Au. Au. Ew. Or how do you say it? Yes. E. Good. U. Good. Yes. It. Uth. Av. Ith. Uth. I. You put this? I. I. Yes. I. E. Good. So read this exercise again. At. 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 Yes. Im. Um. Uh. Would it be in? Yes, in. Just like in English, in. Okay, in. Un. Af. U. Ah, if. Yes. Ash, ish, ush, ak, ik, uk, 
ar ir ur ah yes ich uh az is us ai a a a Good. As is us al il il u at it ut at it ut i u e i e Yes, just like in I English E, it is similar to that E. Okay. Now we we'll proceed to the next lesson, which is lesson number okay. four. So here we will study about long vowels. So in the last lecture we have studied that in Arabic we have six vowels. Three of them are called a short vowel, and other three are called long vowel. Today we will study about long vowel also. If the letter start reading from here. comes after an alphabet with fatha then this alif will be pronounced like double fatha and this a is pronounced like a of father so did you understand it let me see i'm just going to read it to myself uh, one more time okay I'm pretty sure I, I understand. It's okay. Like a extended A sound, I guess. Yes. Uh, take the example of father. In the word father, uh, we write only one A. But when we pronounce the this word, we speak two A. Did you notice ever? We speak father. Yeah. Yes. Here we have pronounced two A, but we have written only one A. So we uh, same thing is here. Here, whenever um, there is whenever there comes a uh, alif after an fatha then this so is uh, telling us that whenever we write alif after a fatha we will uh, pronounce it two time and let me tell you another thing in english we write each alphabet separately like uh, for example this word father all these alphabets are written separately but in arabic alphabets yeah. join to make word they merge in each other to make new words in arabic alphabets merge into each other to make new words so today we will do this also for example ain and alif will merge to make the word a ta and alif will merge to make the word ta fa fatha and alif will merge to make the word fa so now we will read it like this and also since this is alif madda so we will stretch the voice of alif for example listen carefully dal ali dal fatha alif da here i have stretched the voice of alif ra fatha alif ra again i have stretched alif ba fatha alif ba jim fatha alif ja sin alif Oh, sorry. Sin fata alif sa, swad fata alif sa, twa fata alif ta, ha fata alif ha. So just like the English word father, in this uh, in this in this word we will state the voice of alif just like we have stated the voice of a in the word father. So start from the right column vertically. I say the whole alphabet, right? Like so yes, like, yes. Dal fata alif da. Okay. Dal fata alif da. Ra fata alif ra. Ba fata alif ba. 
Jim, Fata Alif, Cha, Sin, Fata Alif, Sa, God, Fata Alif, So, Ta, Fata Alif, Ta, Ha, Fata Alif, Ha, Ain, Fata Alif, A, Ta, Fata Alif, Ta, Fa, Ata, or er, Fata Alif, Fa, Good, Kaf, Fata Alif, Ka, Good, Lam, Fata Alif, La, Mim, Fata Alif, Na, Nun, Fata Alif, Na, Kof, Fata Alif, Ka. Good, read this page again. Then now read it directly. Da, Ra, Ba, and stretch the voice of Alif. Okay. Da, Ra, Ba, Ja, Sa, Sa, Ta, Ha, I, I, A, Good. So remember this point and in Arabic whenever there is uh, Alif after Fata, you will state the voice of Alif. Then I move proceed to the next page long vowel Wu. This is the second long vowel and it is called Wow Madda. So read it. Okay. Um, if the letter Wa with Sukun comes after an alphabet with Dhamma, then this wa, which is called wa mada, will be pronounced like double dhamma u, and this u is pronounced like the vowel <coughs> of food. Yes. <coughs> so here again, we will remember that whenever uh, wa skun is coming after dhamma, we will uh, increase. We will stretch this wa. We will stretch this wa. So again, we have example. Bao Dhamma Vau Bu Jim Dhamma Vau Ju Swa Dhamma Vau Su So read it like this Ba Dhamma Vau Bu Jim Dhamma Vau Wu Ju Ju, sorry <laughs> Yes Ba Ta Dama wow su da sama or dama wow tu ain dama wow u fa dama wow hu kaf kaf dama wow hu lam dama wow Good. You can also read it like this. Lam, Dhamma, Vau, Sakin, Lu. You can also read it like this. You can read it in both ways. Now proceed to the next column. Mim, Dhamma, Vau, Mu. Yes. Nun, Dhamma, Vau, Nu. Ha, Dhamma, Vau, Hu. Ya dama wa yu dal dama wa du zal dama za 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 yes oh yes. That's, oh, okay um you want me to do it again yes is it just za dama wa du oh sorry zu zu za dama Okay, good. Now start from the beginning and this time Bu, Ju, 
su and set the voice of wow Good. Now on the next page, there is third and last long vowel, which is called ya, ya manda. So same thing here. Whenever uh, ya is with sukoon and is coming after kasra, we will stretch its void voice. So start reading it. Okay. If the letter ya comes after an alphabet with kasra. Then this ya mada will be pronounced like double vowel kazra. E and this e is pronounced like the vowel B. Yes, good. Ba kasra ya sakin B. Jim kasra ya sakin G. Sheen kasra ya sakin Shi. Or you can also read it like this. Ta kasra ya T. Ain kasra ya E. Fa kasra ya Fi. So start reading it. Good. Uh, just uh, try to <coughs> stretch a little more the, the pronunciation of all these three long vowels. So now start again from beginning. B G C T E. Okay. B G C T E T K E C L E N E N E P E D D Z. Good. And then now we have exercise and remember to stretch the voice of alif vowel ya da ra ba bu ju b g so stretch the voices so start from the right side vertically Just so I can just say like da. Yes, good. Okay. Ra, ba, ja, sa, sa, da, a, ba. Ka, ka, yeah. Yes. La, ma. Would that be boo? Yes, boo. Okay. Ju. Du. Du. U. U. Fu. 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 
Yes. Who? Yes. Ba. B. Oh, B. Yes. G. C. D. Good. Last column. Okay. <coughs> oh, next. Yes. Okay. It's gonna be fun. <laughs> oh man. Ja. Yes. <coughs> yes. Good. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, mu. Yes. U. Ni. Ni. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Ni. Uh, da. Yes. No. Boo. Ba the ma was a kin boo. Boo. Uh, G. Sa. C. Su. Good. So now read again. This time read uh, horizontally. So and also uh, stretch little mole. You need to stretch little oh. mole. Okay, like every letter. <laughs> Save just uh, three long vowels. Alif, vow, or any ya. Yeah. Stretch them little longer. Okay. Um. Mm. Good. B Ja Ra Ju G U Yes Ba Good Yes. She. Yes. T. Yes. Ja. Tu. Ti. A. U E Yes Mo Good Ta Fu 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 Yes <laughs> Am I saying it right? F F U Fu Yes. Yeah. Fu Good. Fi uh, Ni Yes. Ta Ku Ki Da E 
the ah this is ah ain fata alif ah Boo. 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 Yes. Bad the ma wo sakin boo. Boo. Ba. Mo. Mi. G. Ha. Hu. Ni. La you yes he he I'm trying to I'm trying to make them longer um, yeah. the good ma who you ye <coughs> ye Ye. Oh yeah, ye. Yes. Ye. Uh, su. Good. Su. Next we have lesson number five. Different joint shapes of compound words. So I have told you earlier that in Arabic, alphabets uh, join, uh, merge with each other to make words. So here, alphabets lam and alif have merged. So we will pronounce it just like Lam Alif. Then we pronounce Lam Jim. Then we pronounce Kaf Lam. Then we will pronounce Ba Lam Ba. So start pronouncing it from the first column on the right side. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> so just say Lam Alif. Good. Good. Lam. Calf. Lam. Oh, calf. Lam. Ba. Lam. Ba. Good. Calf. Arif. Good. Ba. Calf. Ba. Oh, ba. Good. The mean ya good cop the ya good the ba lam ya sa noon oops I skipped that one yes ya the noon the Lam. Yes. Ba. Lam. Dal. Yes. Ya. Ba. Ra. Yes. Noon. Sad. Good. Um, ba. Ha. Ra. Yes. Ain. Ain. Yes. Ain. Noon. Ha. Yes. Lam. Ha. Lam. Ya. Ha. Jean. Oh, no, sorry. Ha. Dal. Ta. Ha. Zal. Ta. Ha. <coughs> ha. Zal ta ta min da ya ha. Ah, uh, just hold for a minute, okay? Just hold for yeah. a moment. Okay. Revise it during the break. Just for a minute. No problem.
So let's begin. Okay. Do you know where we left off? Yes, I think ta mim ta. Okay. Ta mim ta ya ha. What? Sin hamza lam. Yes. Ta ha ta. Good. Ba ain tal. Good. Ya sin. Good. Ba, uh, rain, oh, rain, oh, rain, zal. Good. So, is this enough for today, or you want to study more? I think this will be good. <laughs> okay. So, in, tomorrow we'll start from here. <clears throat> uh, okay.